Okay, guys, so in this video, we're going to talk about ADT stock. So ADT stock was up really big on Monday's trading session to jump to an all-time high of, uh, I believe it was around, if we take a look at the chart here, the stock even almost... Uh, uh, almost $20 or so. So hit some resistance at around $20 and leveled out at around $13. So the stock was up pretty big on an announcement that uh, Google was buying a 6.6% stake and the, uh, you know, the shares on a buying frizzy. So let's go to that uh, article. Okay, so here I am on Markets Insider, and it says ADT skyrocks 100% after announcing it will partner with Google on smart home security products. So uh, one of the reasons why I think there's such a high demand for smart security products right now is due to the whole pandemic situation. We saw a lot of uh, people kind of more concerned about their home, you know, with a, a little bit of social unrest and, of course, the uh, protesting and things like that, uh, you know, increased vandalism. Um, I believe, you know, even a lot of businesses uh, at one point in the States had been uh, uh, looted and things like that. There had been some reports surfacing around, uh, you know, Apple and some other big businesses had been dealing with security concerns. And the fact that people are probably a little bit more worried about protecting their homes and things like that. I think this is one of the reasons why Google decided to partner with ADT on a new line of smart home security products. So it just dawned on me, you know, we've been talking of everything about smartphones and smart cars, smart TVs, uh, and smart watches, but I don't think as many people are taking a look at the smart home. So that would be like the next logical step in the whole smart revolution if you were to give it a term or something like that. And the fact that um, people are definitely, I think it's pretty cool that at one point maybe you can walk into your house and actually talk to it and tell it to do things like uh, perhaps, you know, uh, uh, turn on the lights or or check to see if, if all of your locks are secure or do uh, cool things, kind of got similar things that you're seeing with uh, how people are talking to Alexia and things like that. I think that ADT and Google are in a good partnership to kind of deliver that value to not only American homes, but to uh, as businesses as well. So as you can see here in the article, it says ADT said the partnership will combine Google's Nest hardware and services and its technology ADT's installation service and professional monitoring network with a focus on residential and small business security. It said it would offer both do-it-yourself options and professional installation. ADT is expect, said it, it expected to offer customers certain Google devices this year and expand integration in 2021. So the fact that Google is buying a big stake in this company, that is a big, big vote of confidence. And I think that's one of the reasons why so many people have bought the stock. But that's not some of the only good news that I've seen on this company. I saw another a really interesting press release uh, released uh, a few months ago that I think shows that there is going to be a big demand for ADT's products in the future. Okay, so I hope you can see this. Uh, the font is uh, not the greatest, but as you can see here, it says ADT partners with Dollar Tree to deliver industry leading solutions to retail loca uh, locations worldwide. So this was actually posted in, on June 8th, and it says ADT announced today that via ADT commercial, its commercial unit is joined forces with Dollar Tree to help provide protection to its retail store locations. So this is actually the largest contract. Um, that well this obviously this was posted before the google uh investment so we don't know it doesn't really say exactly how big this contract is but we know that uh recently they've been partnering with huge companies like dollar tree and google so this is a really really positive sign so as you can see here it says we're thrilled to be partnered with dollar tree for what makes the largest contract to date for adt commercial so i'm, I'm pretty sure that the google tron check is bigger than this but i just wanted people to see that AD, a lot of companies are worried about home security and i think we're going to see a lot of this renewed interest in security in general show up on their upcoming quarterly report so one of the reasons why i think the stock jumps so much is a couple of reasons so first of all i like to use robin Tr okay and there's also the fact that this stock was number three most uh, added stock on Robin Track, so RobinTrack.net, a really nice site that I like to use to see uh, which stocks are the most bought on uh, the Robinhood platform. So Robinhood is a really, really popular uh, stock trading app. So when people are adding stocks like this, uh, it can really, really help the share price increase. And as you can see here, over 23,000 people added this stock on Monday session uh, over the last 24 hours. So we could see a lot of uh, movement in this stock throughout the rest of the week. I've seen stocks kind of 
you know, price in similar ranges, uh, see huge, huge breakouts uh, in that second day. So what am I talking about with the second trading day? Well, the first thing I like to do is when I'm looking at a stock like this, I like to take a look at the volume. Okay, so if we take a look at the chart here, we can see that the stock is up big on one day volume so as you can see here the volume skyrocketed uh the previous session was about three million uh and then on august 3rd the the volume was 187 million shares so with earnings coming up uh on august 6th it'll really be interesting to see kind of where this stock heads uh i what i ended up doing was i ended up buying it close to the end of the session i uh i ended up buying some shares at around 13 dollars and 70 so i ended up buying some shares around 13 dollars and 73 cents so i'm waiting to see if there will be another bounce uh throughout the week usually with a lot of these uh these stocks that gap up a ton sometimes they can gap up for a second or third day and i'll be looking to see if that happens with adt but i also think that it's a decent long-term investment as well uh, the fact that google is bought a stake in the company is obviously a great long-term bullish trend and the company does pay a small dividend of around 16 cents uh, per share annually. So I think if you're trying to add this stock to your portfolio for long term, you think that uh, home sm the smart homes are going to be a part of the future of America because ADT is a company that's solely basically focused on um, American home security for uh, residential houses and businesses that I think this could be a long term hold as well. And the fact that Google's investing in it long term, that's a good uh, person to invest along with. So I'll also be waiting to see what happens with this stock. Uh, if I hope I'm looking for another bounce, hopefully it can go a lot higher. And we saw kind of sim uh, similar, uh, really high bounce on a play that I really missed. Uh, but uh, was Kodak was Kodak was another stock that went absolutely crazy. So although the dif the difference in market cap was a lot different, you know, ADT is around like a $10 billion company and Kodak was a lot smaller than I think that there's potential for some strong volume throughout the week because I, I, it would be interesting to see how people react after earnings. But I think earnings should be pretty strong. And I did read uh, somewhere that the, uh, the CEO said that uh, demand for their products were obviously up a ton due to the whole pandemic situation. So let's just be really kind of seeing where this stock goes. Uh, if it if it bounces, uh, I'll probably uh, sell it off and take some profits. And if it doesn't really go anywhere, I could potentially also hold it uh, until after earnings to see what happens there. So I'm really, really interested in ADT stock. I think that it has a lot of potential. If, for you guys out there that are dividend growth investors, this could be another stock that you're adding to your portfolio. I think dividend stocks are nice or Obviously, they're not as sexy or not as fast growing as some of the non-dividend paying high growth, hyper growth stocks out there. But uh, the fact that you're getting that income coming and you can actually add to your positions without putting extra money in your portfolio. And for you guys out there that are nearing retirement, uh, having dividend paying stocks pay you income can really, really supplement your income when you stop working. So. Uh, I hope I just kind of explained everything uh, pretty well in this video. So I'm going to be watching this stock closely. So for you guys out there that are going to be trading this stock, uh, be sure to use stop losses. Uh, you don't want to. This isn't the. This, for me, this is a stock that I'm buying now to try to profit off of the quick earnings. I do like ADT long term as well. So like I said, if it goes up, I might be holding it a little bit longer. But for you guys out there that are trading, or if you're using Robinhood or something like that, uh, you know, make sure you use stop loss orders on a stock like this a stock like this that moves so fast as you can see uh, you know, I showed you earlier people had bought this stock at 20 and now it's all the way down to 13 so the way to prevent like big losses when you're buying anything in general is you want to definitely start learning about stop orders you know a lot of times when I buy stocks it's okay to use a market order but a stop order just basically prevents you from having bigger losses so uh, you know anytime you, you'll see people uh, complaining about uh, they're losing a lot of money in a stock or things like that uh, uh, if you're a long-term investor, you probably shouldn't be be too worried if the price is going down because if you're going to be holding the shares for like five or ten years, then you want to buy more. But for you guys out there that are trying to make money in the markets and trying to trade up and things like that, you really, really want to use stop loss orders that can prevent a lot of unwanted losses. So uh, th this is about to wrap things up about ADT stock. Uh, really, really interesting and, and really nice to see a, a vote of confidence. And I think that smart homes are a future of the American landscape. We're going to see a lot more cool things happen, just like we saw with. Uh, 
you know, smart cars and smartphones. I think this is the decade for smart homes, and apparently Google thinks so as well. So that's it for now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please smash the thumbs up button if you like my content. And smash that red subscribe button for more videos on stocks that are uh, moving on high volume and companies that I think are good long-term investments. And I also covered dividend growth stocks as well. So that's it. until next time, guys. Take care.